most people stayed home. Most people didn't even show up to vote. Donald Trump has said a lot of inflammatory things. Why not Hillary Clinton? Why not? How much time you got, bro? I could go on and you know what I'm saying? Like, how much time do you got, bro? Donald Trump is just reckless. I'm scared now because he has control of a lot of stuff he should not have control over right now. I think mostly they're irrational. When you're afraid, you act irrationally. Americans don't know why we're in the Middle East. They don't know why Muslims that come from the Middle East are involved in terror. They think it's because they're Muslim. But fear is their tool, period. I voted not him more than it was for her. Do you think Hillary stole it from her? Yes, I do. Well, I, I love my country, but I also know that we've got warts and scars and blisters too. I remember when people would run their campaigns on just saying what their issues were. Why is no one listening to the people? I don't understand. That's the whole point. I'm frustrated with people who say, oh, it's Obama's fault. The things that are wrong in government, he's a part of the problem now. And the things that are right in government, he's a part of the solution. You're only speaking about building a wall on one quadrant of this country. And we're not talking about the East and West Coast or even the right above us, it was Canada. We're speaking specifically about the Mexicans. And you want to protest something that you're passionate about, by all means do that. Because when it was a landslide and she's got it on lockdown, the process was A-OK. -okay. A lot of people don't want a woman in office. They don't want a woman leading the country. I would say that Hillary would be the wrong woman. I am an Arab American, uh, you know, and so, so they go, all right, now I know how not to talk to you. I want to know the unblemished, awful, naked truth. I think that if everybody felt the same way, we wouldn't be fighting amongst ourselves. We'd be working toward a common goal. I think there's only one thing more powerful than fear, and that's hope. And not let people divide us.